this tip of the day, let's take a look at creating a cross-sectional view using the One CNC Page Manager. Now in this example, we're starting off with just a simple part. This is a solid model. And to enter into the Page Manager, we're going to head down to the lower left-hand corner and select the Page Manager tool. Now the very first thing we need to do is to create a page. So I'm going to select the option called Add a Page. And from the templates, I'm going to use the ANSI A template. So we'll click OK to that. Now I can start quickly adding our different views. So to begin with, how about a wireframe top view? I'm going to click Add to Page. I'm just going to place it right about there. How about a right view? Click the right view, Add to Page. Move it just to the right, about like that. How about a front view? That looks good. Add to Page. I'm going to drag and just place that right about there. All right, and now let's say we want to create a cross-sectional view that passes right through the center of this boss. Well, to do that, we need to create a construction plane right at the location where we want to create the cross-section. This is very simple, so let me demonstrate how to do this. We're going to exit out of the Page Manager and go into Model Space by clicking either one of these arrows in the lower left-hand corner. From here, we're going to change our construction plane by selecting our construction plane tools. And why don't we change our construction plane to the default XZ construction plane. Very good. Now I'm going to move that construction plane right to the very center of the boss by using this very first option called position plane. All I need to do is take my cursor and snap a vertice where I want to place that plane. That is perfect. Let's go back into our paper or page space again by clicking one of those arrows. We're going to open up the page manager. And from here, we're going to select the option called Create Section from Plane. I'm going to left click. As soon as I do this, there's a new view that's been created called Section 2. I'm going to left click, and there you can see there's the cross-sectional view. All I need to do now is select Add to Page, and I can drag and place that anywhere that I'd like. Once we're done with that, I'm going to close the Page Manager, and that's it. It's a very fast way to create cross-sections using one CNC. All right, that's it for this tip of the day. Thank you so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Don't forget to click the subscribe button.